What's up, everybody? Welcome back to some more Persona 3 Portable. Um, yes, this is, I've been doing a little bit of off-screen grinding. I did a couple of, uh, fusion requests. And now we can fuse... Whoa. Hello there, my friend. Um, I want to get some good moves. Let's see. Um, can I get Alice's die for me on here? Um... I guess this will do. All of these personas I've desperately grinded for. They finally become... Yeah, um... That's what Orpheus evolved into? I'm Thantos. I was born of thee and I shall walk by thy side. Yeah. So... Interesting. This thing was... The second persona we saw... Before... Um... You know. Oh, we got a weapon master. Hmm. Oh, these are some good moves. I don't have uh, anything to put fear on, so. Brave Blade. Yeah. Now, since I did take a couple of, uh, it did take, take a little while to, uh, get the personas and also diffuse them, look up guys, how to do shit, um, I'm trying to get, get every single persona I got back. It's just gonna take a little while, so... I was meaning to do a bit of grinding, going back into Tartarus, but apparently the game is just like, nope, you can't go any further for a while. Shit. I don't want Thor yet. Do I want this guy? Nah. You want a fortune persona? So yeah, we got death now. Oh, I already got sick free, never mind. Uh, don't want a hang biker. Yes. The Greek god of death, he's a son of Nyx. Okay, we got the son of Nyx in our party. And the brother of Hypnos. He is dis despite it as a young man with an inverted torch and a well and a wreath or butterfly in his hand? TF. And also I had a few Alice, which had die for me. Um Ghost appears as a young blonde girl. She seems young, but has formidable magic powers. Some say she's a ghost of a poor English girl who died in an unfortunate accident. Yeah, so I had to get a bunch of death personas. And... Ugh, it was not a fun time. It took me a little while. But hey, we finally did it. Okay, so then it's gonna... Okay, I can't add any more personas in. So what I was going to do was to like go back into Tartarus, but I grinded a little bit. Everybody else is still like the same at like ish. Let's just return to the dorm actually. It's Wednesday. Emperor's birthday, there's no school. What's going on here? thought you were gonna go visit your mother's grave. Oh, hi, Sonata-san. Is this where you should be? Well, I was planning to, but when I thought about what I was gonna say to her, it just didn't feel right. There are things I still need to do before I talk to her again. Yeah, same here. I don't have anything I need to tell Shinji right now. I have my own stuff to deal with. Yeah. An undefeatable enemy, huh? Gosh, wonder what it's like. You got me. But it doesn't matter, because I've made up my mind. I'm gonna look it straight in the eyes. Straight in the eyes? Intel go fuck itself. I like the sound of that. You can count me in too. Yeah. Well. <laughs> it's time to do one more thing. Because I've recently realized that since, um... 
I looked up, and it says that we have until the end of January left, so... And... With a bunch of these social links still left to... You know... Do? I'm kinda nervous. I don't think I'm actually gonna 100% complete this game like I wanted to. So, um... Kinda... Sad for me to say, but, um... After school. Never mind then. But hey. I'm going to at least try my damnest to get maximum social link. To do a maximum social link run. Even though it is my first attempt at playing this game. There you are. Thanks for coming down here. Uh, never mind. I came for the hospital. I still have to pick up my sister from preschool. Go shopping. Laundry, I got so much to do. That's up. Sure, if I can handle it. It's the kind of stuff mom had to do every single day. Fell silent. I'm gonna skip out on track. I don't have the time anymore. Even with the scholarship, I don't think we can afford college. I mean, for living expenses, my family can't even pay their own. I already lost dad's income. No mom can't work. I'm not that earn a living. I don't have any choice but to give up track. Damn, I wish Dad were still alive. Can't do much about it. Yeah, I guess, but still, I want to challenge you one last time. He seems regretful. I enjoy track because I gotta compete with people. Is it really going in like this? Don't give up, man. Right, I come too far. I want to take part in the meet. I devote a lot of my life to track. I'm going to take all that experience, apply what I learned, and achieve victory. I'm glad we could talk. I feel a lot better about things now. Thanks, man. It's a goal now. Oh, don't want to keep my sister away and see ya. Back to the dorm it is. Hello. Eight more days. I'm gonna fight. When I thought about it, I realized that there wasn't a choice to be made. I don't want to tell my mom and Shinjiro-san that we failed. Alright. Hmm. Let's go with Yukari. Archon always looks happy when we get a holiday. Much because it means everyone's at the dorm. I have a weird question. Sounds weird. You know what day tomorrow is, right? We have some ready just in case if you have time. Um. Shit, I forgot to get her a gift. Oh, there it is. Well, your nose is all dirty. Come here, let's clean you before we go home. Damn, I forgot to get some for uh, Yukari. Hopefully I have time. Oh my god. I really don't care at this point. I, don't, I threw my shield away because... I wait till the last minute, but today's Christmas. Maybe I have something that uh, she likes. Ready? We have all. We don't have all night, you know. We still have a curfew. Let's go to blowing them off. They are, they're going to have lights. Supposedly, transfer the place. How beautiful! I'm looking forward to it. Oh, that's so, so pretty, so romantic. Really is beautiful. Yeah. You can look I at this look all night long. Did you know they brought in a famous designer to oversee the decorations? Okay. That was voice acted, apparently. Here. Or was everything voice acting? I didn't notice. It's been a while, so I hope it tastes all right. Ooh. I hope you like it. Hmm. You want some perfume? Oh, you got me something! Oh, wow! Is this really for me? Oh, man. I think I'm gonna cry. I've made up my mind. I'm gonna make up for this next year. Thank you. Huh? When I first met you, I never thought we'd be spending time together like this. I was so used to being alone. I wouldn't say this to anyone else. But I've been dreaming of a moment like this. So, even though we're in such a crazy situation right now, just for today, I wanna be by your side. Aww. Can I please, um, the answer social link? Wow, look at the 
time. We can stay a little longer, right? I'm sure everyone else is going to be late getting back, too, since it's Christmas. It's not really Christmas. Oh, it's Christmas. not Junpei. I'm sure he's hanging out with the guys. But, oh, that's a little off subject. What I wanted to say was, I want to be with you a little longer tonight. Oh. Hey, are you cold? Oh, well. It's cold, right? Uh, can I come closer? <laughs> How about if you... Wrap your arms around me. Okay. <sighs> now it's Christmas. And we're in school for Christmas. What the fuck is this bullshit? Ah, Fuka chan. Alright. I want you to try something for me. Don't worry, it won't be like before. We'll be able to eat this time. Wait, can I say the same thing? Oh, here. Please try it. Round object. A flavored rice ball. Ooh, smells good. Holy shit, it's edible. It's good. Well, how does it taste? It's really good. I made it today in home economics class. Learned how to make a rice ball in high school sounds strange. Remember why I told you that I had to get better at cooking? Well, since then I've been practicing making rice balls every day. There's some to make, but perfecting their taste is quite difficult. Everyone at home at Novice Pass kept telling me how good my rice balls taste today. So I... So showing my appreciation, I bought you one. You taught me so much. Thank you for everything. Well, I could help. Um... said this before, but when I'm with you, I think more positively. I'll make people happy. That's probably why I did such a good job on the rice ball. I can't concentrate on who was going to eat it. Uh, um... Shit. But I'm looking Kari. I'm a chain bastard now. Oh my, look how late it is. Let's go home. Where have you been? With Fuka. You know what to say, Zone 25? <sighs> Fate, death will be a terrible Christmas. We better next year. That's right, next year we're not going to let the world end. Hell yeah. I'm going to fuck shit. Up. I just realized that I forgot to do uh, the thing for. Um... All right, let's do it tomorrow. Hey, we do have a little break up ahead. I think we got a text or something. Conversation over here. Um. Mm. All right. It's morning. Alright, winter break starts tomorrow. For sure you're just gonna sleep in during New Year's. So rely on your parents. Don't forget fall don't fall asleep in Kitatsu. Um that was a futon. Oh shit, I accidentally stayed awake. And, like my academics don't need to be increased any further, but what the hell. Woohoo! I know how to spend it. Winter break begins tomorrow. Thank god we at least have a winter break. All right. All right, come to my room. So, this is the student dormitory where you spend your days. It's my room. So, this is your room. I've never seen many of these things before. Anyway, regarding my request to visit your room, well, did it make you a little suspicious? Not really. I see. Actually, I do have something I'd like to talk to you about. She seems us unusually hesitant. Sure, let's listen to her story. During my forays into your world, I encountered many things. All of them are treasured memories. Each one a polished, glittering gem. Walking around the crowded Port Island streets, Sampling the local cuisine, idling the hours away at the shrine, even attending your school for a day. That's when I came to a realization. I had subconsciously been requesting to visit places that were more and more central to your life. And so today, I requested to visit the one place in your world that I could learn the most about you. Oh. I requested to visit your room, if I may be so bold. 
Uh oh. Do you recall the day you gave She's me blushing. your school? How I mentioned that I felt very fulfilled when I touched you? Uh, I remember. It was the first time I ever felt that way. Why did I feel so fulfilled after coming here? I can finally answer that question. I believe it's because I could feel what you feel and truly experience your life for the first time. We who reside in the Velvet Room wait with great anticipation for guests. Their arrival is our only link to the outside world and gives us a reason to be. By touching you like this, I can have that all for myself. I think I see. Put it more plainly, I'm naive to the ways of your world. And there must have been many times I seemed to act quite strangely. Yep. However, even I am not blind to the significance of calling upon a gentleman in his own room. If you wouldn't mind, I'd like you to guide me through it. What the f- <laughs> Okay, um... Sure, let's do it. He doesn't even tell us what we did. I feel like a completely different person than the Elizabeth who first stepped into your world. <sighs> if I stay on this side any longer, I fear I will forget my duties entirely. What did I? What we do? And that would put you at a severe disadvantage, wouldn't it? That is why I'll draw a line under my visits here and remain on my side from now on. Aww. Thank you very much for acting as a guide on my journey of discovery. I'm very grateful. Now then, though the sorrow may be sweet, let us part. Um, show me your room. Um, about what happened? Um, please keep what happened in your room. Um, I confuse. Can a bird-like persona that gl glides over the battlefield. Higher and higher rises. Um, I think we just... I think we just fucked. Um, interesting. Um... How do I make this persona? Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Can I want to make a black frost too, just so I can. I don't know. Um. Hope you card doesn't know what happened. Um. Oh yeah. All right. Let's just. Let's just go chill if you call her Max on her social link. Then I'll worry about the rest. Although I... Have significantly high doubts. Um... Back to the rooftop. Um... Oh! Don't scare me like that. Oh, sorry. I don't want to ask you, um... I spent so much time with me. I've been caught up in so many things because you're with me. And honestly, I don't want to bitch. <laughs> wow. Wow. I would like to hear Yukari's voice acting say, I've been a bitch. Is it because we're both Persona users or are we actually good friends? What do you think of me? Uh, you know, lately. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I want you to look at me and... She see me with Fuka. I feel so bad now. Um, okay, okay, I, I, I won't talk to her anymore. I won't talk to her anymore. So will you... What am I saying? I gotta go. I'm so... I feel bad now. Welcome back. Sup? Five days left. In my mind. How are you... Christmas come. New Year's Eve, you made your decision? 
Yeah. So much BS. She see me with Fuka. As Kormor been thinking about the days to come, Kormor's eyes are filled with the light resolution. Winter vacation begins. Huh? Junpei Kun? Oh, hey, Fuka. What are you doing here? Nothing, really. I come here when I'm feeling down. Is that Chidori's sketchbook? Hmm? Oh, yeah. This is where I first met her. What are you doing here, Fuka? Oh, I went home for a bit. I've been going back there a lot lately. I see. You know, you've really changed, Fuka. You're totally different from when you first came to the dorm. Really? Yeah, you were so timid back then. But now you're so... strong. You've changed too, Junpei-kun. Yukatan said all the did. same thing. But I don't think so. I mean, just the other day I got all freaked out about being scared. I am such a wuss. <laughs> That's not true. But I really was scared. Actually... I'm still scared. Pretty sure we all are. But after thinking about it, I realize that I don't want to lose my memory. If I forget everything, that means I'll forget Chidori too. And I wouldn't even be alive right now if it wasn't for her, you know? So I say F that. You're scared because you're not running away. That's nothing to be ashamed of. Hell yeah. Luka. That's why I want to protect everyone. Think about it. The dark hour is really scary too, isn't it? But our persona's awakened, and we're here today. The future hasn't been decided yet, and I want to be true to myself. True to yourself? You're really something, Fuka. We should fight. I agree. Find out what they're doing. Fighting Nyx. Diamond. And pearls. What's this little dude right here? Okay. Oh Christ. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, there's a little pot. there's a little hole right there. So good. Um oh. hmm. Could spot you a few deals. Nah, that's fine. So a little left, hopefully. Oh. But my mom? She gets to come home from the hospital soon. Ooh, nice! Hopefully I can help her a bit more, since I finally got the hang of taking care of everyone. Guess what? My club mate, clubmates say they can take, help me take care of stuff. One of them offered to pick up my sis from preschool. Everybody seems so worried about me. I mean, who thought I was the only one who cared, and I ended up ignoring everyone else there. After all that, it's probably my fault no one seemed focused on winning. I need to check something. Alright. That's right. You'll love for a second, do you? I feel better about everything. Now that I know how people will really feel about the club and everything. Just my last fun. My body feels so light now. Well, I guess I kind of just started rambling there. I gotta run. Later. And while you remember this, I'm able to focus on sports again because you gave me a push. Having fun, thanks to you. My gate. Later. We jogged off back to the dorm with this. Hi, how was your day? Good. Four more days. Think about what I'm going to do on the 31st. For am I going crazy my fear? But I was wrong. I feel strong because everyone's with me. Oh, Junpei. It's freezing out here. Hey, Kormaru, let me borrow your fur. Please. You already made your decision, right? Yeah, I made mine too. I just wanted to let you know. Oh, I saw Fuka today. She's pretty tough. She wasn't like that before, but she's gotten way stronger. Talking to her was like that last little shove I needed. Girls are tough, and that's no joke. <laughs> are you saying me too? Don't worry, dude. Everyone knows what a tough little doggy you are. Winter break continues. 
Who should we hang up? There's probably no one we can hang out with today. Unless they're like scattered all about. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, sweet shop. Damn it, I won't go in the sweet shop. Pork. Um. <sighs> I probably can't go to the school, but. Hmm. I read online that a good way to, uh. Wait, what? Hmm. Okay, fortune box. Yes. No financial worries and great health. If someone's a, a lucky charm and 10,000 yen. Oh, nice. My condition has just improved a great. Hi, how was your day? Good. Three more days. Yeah. How was, I guess. <laughs> really, she just read my mind. Well, let's go to bed, I guess. There's my crap. I wonder if he's gonna be there. He isn't. Another day that I absolutely have nothing here to do. Shrine it is. Worst luck, health and great danger. 5,000 yen? And I feel tired. Come on, man. Accepted. Nothing. Day's almost here. I'm gonna fight with all I got, and I know we're gonna win. Got some confused thing about it, but then I figured it out. Whatever the next is, all we gotta do is just kill it. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Still tired. I'll just go to the bathroom. Hello. Hey, it's me. Can I talk to you? Right there. Hey, I have good news. I guess is coming back today. Finally. Mitsuru Senpai said her wounds have finally healed. We're meeting in the lounge tonight. Don't forget, okay? See ya. Okay. Ah, oh, finally. It's been a while since I guess came back. Well, um, back to the strip mall? Oh, there you are, mate. Let's go and grab ourselves some chow, actually. So the big meat was yesterday. You went? My question is that. I got first place, of course. Woohoo! Ah, oh, jeez, who do you think I am? Well, thanks, anyway. That means my sports career might be over for real. Makes me feel a little empty, you know? What's next for you? I think I'm gonna find a job, actually. I'm gonna earn enough money to support my family. I think that's my responsibility now. I wanna pick down everything. Everything. My father had connections at a car factory, so I'll apply there. It's pretty far away. Or actually noodles saw me. Um... Thanks. You helped me realize a lot of stuff, you know? I always blame school and my family for everything. I didn't want to face up to the fact that I was responsible. I really lucked out, you know. If we haven't met, I'd still be a jerk. I won't forget you. Well, I have to get to start packing. Thank you for enough. Just grab by after school again. 
She knows how many chances we're gonna have after this. Unless you get passed up. I guess it returned. I'm back, everyone. Sorry to have worried you all. You were gone for a fucking month. Man, I'm glad to see you. I was getting nervous. <gasps> Me too. I was fearing the worst. I'm a machine, so I can always be rebuilt. Even if I was completely destroyed, the programming data necessary to recreate me would still exist. Hey, don't talk about yourself like that. They said another week would be required for a complete recovery, but I had the process expedited. Tomorrow is New Year's Eve. I'm sorry for all the trouble I've caused. Mitsuru-san visited me at the lab and told me everything. That must have been difficult for you all to hear. Have you been well? I mean, considering the circumstances. Worry about you. I'm sorry. It's because I wasn't strong enough. Ten years ago, I... What I did to you was... You didn't have any choice. But if I hadn't done that to you, you wouldn't be suffering like this. Ryoji has presented you with a difficult choice. Have you made your decision? Yep. I have a favor to ask of you. Tomorrow, when Ryoji comes, please, please kill him. I think you're the only one here who asked me to kill him. I can't bear to see everyone hurting like this. Please choose to have your memories erased. Even if, even if it means forgetting everything and everyone. I guess, what are you talking about? Yeah, this isn't like you. What's wrong, I guess? Why? Why did I come back here? My mission is to protect humanity from shadows. But now I know that I can't defeat them. So then, why am I here? I'm useless. <sighs> I cannot even shed a tear for you all. Oh, I guess. Why fight when you know that you can't win? What is the purpose of that? Because what the fuck else are you supposed to do? Why are you wasting your lives? We're not wasting our lives. We're just planning for the future. Right, Ken? Right. I... I don't understand. It must be because I don't possess a life. <laughs> this has nothing to do with having a life. I'm a machine. A machine that was created to protect humans from shadows. But I can't fulfill that mission with the powers I was given. So then, what is my purpose now? Could someone please tell me? We don't know the answer, I guess. Yeah. The only one who can tell you what your purpose is, is you. That's why we're having such a hard time making our decision. There's just no easy answer. But as long as we're alive, we have to do something. When we see others hurting, we want to help them. So that's our purpose. <laughs> I'm not too good at explaining it, but that's what we all think. Can finding one's purpose really be so simple? Not really. When I saw you collapse, I realized something. I want to protect you. I don't want to forget about you. Fuka-san. There are times when you will lose sight of your goal, and you will have to search for it. But if you can't find it again, then you must set your heart on a new goal. I'm not really one to talk, but I feel that I've come to understand something important this year. To truly live, you will need to make changes sometimes. Do you think I can do that? Do you think I can change? Yes. I mean, you've changed so much already. Haven't you noticed? In fact, you're changing even as we speak. I know what my purpose is. I'm a machine. A machine who is here to live. And the one who has given me this new purpose is... me. Hell yeah. This is the promise I've made to myself. I don't know how I'll do it, but I guess that is part of living, too. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, finally. Bye-bye. Holy crap. Wow. You really had to name it after what I nicknamed my Eevees?
Athena. Will you allow me to join with you all? Of course. You've always been one of us. Thank you. I will be with you all, no matter what happens. That's the spirit. Nice. Whoa. Revise an ally restoring HP. We just got Diorahan. What are you going to get rid of? Like, something? You do have Kiss of Athena, so you kind of got the same gun as your persona, but... Tomorrow's a dreadful day, I guess. Fuck. Alright, sorry for that. Today's the time. It's New Year's Eve. Another full moon. Oh, do stuff then. Oh, forgot about that. Eight diamonds. Oh yeah, do I already got this? Never mind then. Um. Let's go to the shrine and hope that. It is time. The promised day. We all just return. You have to make your decision now. Hey, long time no see. Midnight's just around the corner. At midnight, I will change from this form into something unrecognizable. So, have you reached a decision? Everyone's silent. Okay. I'll be waiting in his room until midnight. Come see me when you have your answer. Ryoji-kun. Oh, and one more thing. Don't let the fact that you'll have to kill me influence your decision. As I said before, I'm going to disappear anyways. I won't feel any pain by dying. So there's no need to worry about me. I'll be waiting. Have you made your decision? Yeah. I see. Have the rest of you made your decision? No need to ask me. You know how I feel. I wouldn't be here if I wasn't on board. I'm with the rest of you. I'm in too. <laughs> I have made my decision as well. Then we're all in agreement, yes? Better let him know then, okay? Yeah. It's time. My room. He's just standing in the corner. Hey. What's up? It's been a long time since we talked like this in your room. Yeah. It was the day after... The final full moon. Although back then, I didn't appear in this form, and wasn't known by this name. Don't tell me you've all decided to let me live. You're all going to risk your lives on a battle you can't win. But you're the only one here right now, so... I'll say this one more time. If you kill me, Tartarus, the Dark Hour, and your memories of the battles will all disappear. Tomorrow, you'll wake up a normal high school student. You'll be able to live in peace until the moment of the fall. But if you let me live, you'll spend every waking moment until that day in fear of your inevitable death. Nyx cannot be defeated. It's useless to fight her. Really? Are you just saying this just to throw me off, or are you being serious? Are you still thinking? No. Or have you already made up your mind? I have made up my mind. This is a very important decision. You must choose wisely. Kill Ryoji or Lem live. Oh, I feel like if I do one, I get an ending, and the other, I get another ending. I think the true ending is to let him live. I guess my words didn't change your mind. Nope. There's still some time until midnight. I didn't want to have to show you this, but I have no choice. Holy shit, you're Thantos. See? 
I'm not human. I will bring death to this world until I am finally satiated. Do not hesitate to kill me. I want you to think about this carefully. Is facing Nyx really the best decision? Some things in this world cannot be changed. You do not understand this yet. Memories are ambiguous. Old ones can be replaced with new ones, creating a new reality. Don't you want to end all your friends' pain and suffering? It's up to you. You are the only one who can make this decision. Now, this is your last chance. Tell me your answer. I already made up my mind, Ryoji. No matter what form you bring, no matter what happens, you know what I'm thinking of. I understand. It's regrettable, but it's your life. You can do what you want with it. I will respect your decision. Let's go back to the lounge. I need to tell you guys how to confront Nyx. So you were lying, I guess. Everyone run out with you a look of relief. Yo, what's up, Ryoji? <sighs> it's an unfortunate decision, but it is yours to make. That's right. But you can't defeat Nyx. It's impossible. Stop telling us this bullshit. But we must still try. Personally, I don't care if it is impossible. I understand. It's almost midnight, so I'll keep this brief. I'll tell you where to find Nyx. You'll find her at the top of Tartarus. Well, here comes five hours of time. On the promised day, you must journey to the top of the tower. When's the promised day? Exactly one month from tomorrow. January 31st, 2010. That's the end game. Nyx will descend to Tartarus, and the world will end. One month. Tartarus is a gigantic rift in the darkness of the night sky. It's a beacon to guide Nyx. With the Apprisers coming, Nyx learns that the way has been prepared and descends there. And thus, the Demise will come. So that's why it's called the Tower of Demise. But what you're saying is, we can fight Nyx if we reach the top? That's right. But remember, from today you will fight against eternal despair. Like I've said so many times before, Nyx cannot be defeated. Are you sure about that? When you face her, you will finally understand this truth. And then you will realize what it is you are trying to stand against. We understand. There's no need to keep telling us. January 31st. We won't forget that date. Well, I'll be going on ahead of you then. I want to leave you while I'm still in this form. Ryoji-kun. I guess. I'm sorry for all the pain and suffering I put you through. I won't forget that you were my enemy. And my friend. I guess. Thank you. This will probably be the last time I'll see you all like this, but I'll always be watching over you. Well, goodbye. Goodbye, Ryoji. Best wishes in the coming year. That's what you say on New Year's Eve, right? See ya. <laughs> that Ryoji. We have one month until January 31st. Together, we'll reach the top. You made an important decision with everyone. You feel a strong bond with your friends. And that is the end of the floor, Connor. Started from, a from April all the way to, ch to December 31st. Susano, oh, damn it, I hate that thing. From the Bravely series, from Bra from Bravely Default, <sighs> forge a bond that cannot be broken. The Raging God. An important decision for your comrades. Your relationship with them has grown stronger, and reached a new level of closeness. Oh, which one are we going to start now? There's only two left. Judgment. All right. I was wondering when we would get to start that social link up. You've established a Nyx Annihilation Team social link with Judgment Arcana. You know, that, all, all that leaves is the Aeon. A new year is about to begin. In one month, you will face Nyx. You must reach the top of Taurus by that day. This is the decision you all made. 2009 is drawing close. It was, it was a year filled with many memories. 
Friday. Like you and Ken and Cormor are already awake. Good morning. Oh, um, Happy New Year, Senpai. Happy New Year's to you too. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you too, Koro. Oh man, I completely overslept. Why'd I stay up all night watching that stupid movie? Did you guys see it? It had these giant Amazon women running around in the jungle. Why would I watch that? <laughs> um, is anyone gonna visit the shrine? No, I don't believe in superstitions. Me either. Oh, that's too bad. Yukari-san and the others are already there. They're all wearing kimonos. Kimonos, huh? Uh, I'm gonna run to the store. Hold it right there, Junpei. Uh, what? You're going to the shrine, aren't you? N no, I'm not. I'm, uh, I'm just going for a walk. Uh, oh, yeah? Well, I'm going with you, then. I'm bored. Oh, I'll go, too. All right, then. Let's go. I'm g Anyone know where it is? Yeah, the girls told me the directions. Sweet! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I just, like, nonchalantly changed from, like, Akiko just, like, no. We, I'm coming with you too, and then just like, yeah, let's just go to the fucking shrine. Happy New Year! Let's all do our very best this year. Hey, you guys are late. We were just about to leave. Yucatan. What? Happy New Year. Hmm? What's the matter, Yori? Mitsuru Senpai. You look hot. I, um, <laughs> I mean. Stop staring at me. Happy New Year's, everyone. I've never worn a kimono before. Um, does my sash look okay? Fuka, you look... Wow! Um, I'm just gonna pick up Junpei and throw him into the river. Jeez, this traditional clothing is quite interesting. However, it's difficult to move in. Uh, hi, John. Considering what you usually wear, that looks even more amazing on you. Uh, is that so? What is this odd sensation I feel? They seem to be embarrassed by the clothing. I guess that is. Uh, I'm I so glad I came. New Year's kicks ass. Yeah! Junpei san, why are you acting so strange? Man, we got to see some great stuff today. Right, Akihiko senpai? Uh, I, uh, I guess so. Hey, aren't you guys cold? Mm, a little, but I love this time of year. Um, that's not what I meant. Junpei san said that you guys aren't wearing anything underneath your kimonos. He said what? Huh? Wow, you've really taken Ken Kun under your wing, huh? Uh, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Ow! Oh, shit. You okay? Do I say that? Don't make things up. But, but you... Um... I'm not used to seeing girls look like that. I'm kind of embarrassed to look at them. Hey, Fuka! Sash makes it hard to breathe. What? You want to leave? I was no longer. I guess. I drew a paper for you by great luck. I am anticipating great, excellent results. How would Stupe say such a thing to a kid? <laughs> Interesting. I'm talking to Chupe. Uh, Coral? Why are you still wearing your C's armband? Sure. What did you wish for, Fuka? I... I wished for a great year. It's a bit generic, but that's what I really want. That's what I want as well. How <laughs> funny. We all wished for the same thing. I'm gonna blame but you. But it wasn't a plea for help. I know that we'll be victorious. Yeah, I'm sure we can do it. We should get going. Yeah. I regret to inform that my sister has expressed a desire to test you. If you are interested, please enter the door that is appeared at the entrance of Tartarus. You can reach my sister from there. Okay. Oh, the music's different. Well, it's time to end this episode, guys. Let me see the social link stats. Button. 
It's these members who vowed to go to the promised place. Shinjiro is still there. <laughs> Rep Shinjiro. Man, he'd be a good person. Hey, we still got like one, two, three, four, five, five, five social links left to max out. And six as soon as we got, I guess it's but anyway, I'm gonna end off today's episode. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Persona 3 Portable. In the next episode, I think we're gonna go back to Tartarus and go to I think the final block slash see what Elizabeth's sister wants. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!